Upon receipt of your new Stealth DRS automatic scrubber, it will need to be unpackaged and removed from the pallet. This video will explain the proper way to unpackage the machine. There are a few tools that will be needed to properly install the Stealth DRS riding scrubber. A sharp cutting tool such as scissors or a razor knife, a 10 millimeter wrench or socket, and a Phillips head screwdriver or electric drill. Begin by cutting the bands that hold the box to the pallet. Then remove the outer box from the pallet. Now remove the battery charger that is sitting on the seat of the machine. Next, remove the plastic bag from the machine. Remove the pad drivers and brush shrouds that are sitting in the operator compartment. Next, cut the two bands that secure the machine to the pallet. Remove the wood ramp and squeegee assembly from the pallet. The wheel blocks will need to be removed in order to drive the machine off the pallet. A Phillips head screwdriver or electric drill will be required for this operation. Open the battery compartment and connect the batteries. Remove keys from the operator manual packet, insert the key and turn the machine on. This will automatically raise the brush deck and squeegee carriage. Use the plywood provided to create a ramp against the pallet. Be sure to disengage the parking brake. Make sure the iDrive selector is set to Machine Transport Mode. This is the leftmost selection. Press the direction switch to select Forward. Press the drive pedal to move the machine off the pallet. Once on the floor, remove the bolts on the brush deck using a 10 millimeter wrench or socket. There are four bolts on each side of the deck. Next, install the side skirts using the bolts that were previously removed from the deck. The squeegee assembly will need to be unwrapped and installed on the machine. Be sure to position the tension spring and washer at the top of the carriage. Position the lugs into the carriage and tighten the thumb wheel. Then attach the vacuum hose to the squeegee shoe. Now, remove the pad drivers from the box and detach the pad center lock. Position the preferred type of pad on the pad driver and screw the center lock to lock it into place. Now, install the pad drivers on the machine by spinning the left brush in a counterclockwise direction and the right brush in a clockwise direction. Be sure to read the owner's manual for important safety, maintenance, and operation instructions. Visit www.betco.com for more information about the Stealth DRS Automatic Scrubber.